A gas station owner says a billboard looming over his place is bad for business, and he wants someone to take that political ad down. News 8's Allie Reed has details tonight from our Fairfield County newsroom. Allie. Good evening, guys. The gas station owner says the billboard is causing him to lose business, and he says there are really two main issues here. He says the first is the offensive language used on the billboard. He says it's offended several of his customers, and the second, he says, is the proximity of the sign to his gas station. Because it does look like it's on our property, and it's, you know, causing commotion here. The billboard, which accuses President Obama of being the entry drug to socialism, is located just two feet away from this gas station in Milford. It's so close that the gas station owner says his customers think it's his billboard, and if they don't like it, they don't stop to fuel up. The station owner is out of the country on business, so we talked to him about the issue over Skype. And we have to explain, no, it's not ours. That's if they ask, and some other people don't ask and they don't appreciate it and they just leave. Without giving you business? Correct. So have you been losing business as a result? Yes, since then I lost quite a bit. The billboard and property it's on are owned by a Milford realtor. We asked him what he thought about the claims that his billboard is hurting a local business. It doesn't seem to be hurting his business, but if it is, I'm certainly uh, never intended to hurt anybody's business. The gas station owner says for the past month it's been up, the billboard's offensive language has insulted his customers, and he wishes the act of free speech would take place a little farther away from his business. The billboard owner says he will take down the billboard, but not until after the November election. Reporting live at the Fairfield County Newsroom at the Connecticut Post in Bridgeport, Allie Reed, News 8.